Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. In the thumbnail of the video, you could see antennas marked on Su-30 MKI. Four antennas are visible, but two of them, which is at the end of the fighter jet's fuselage, is not visible. And we have tried to show that from other Su-30 MKI image where we could see those antennas. The turquoise color antenna, which is visible around the Su-30 MKI, is DRDO's latest developed radar warning receiver. It is digital Dhruti radar warning receiver, also known as DR-118. It has been developed based on the experience of a D-29 radar warning receiver developed for MiG-29 UPG fleet. When pilots and crews undertake a mission, the aircraft's radar warning system provides them vital and timely information about the potential threats from the ground or air. The primary function of RWR is to detect potentially hostile radars and providing pilots and crews enhanced situational awareness and improved survivability. Talking about Dhruti, it is a state-of-art six-channel digital radar warning receiver that not only offers a wide dynamic range and large bandwidth of detection, but also offers good sensitivity, selectivity, and wide instantaneous bandwidth. It is a multi-bit digital RWR and can intercept a wide range of bandwidths and track emitters in real time. The 6RWR can provide the coverage of almost 360 degrees. Now, as we know that Super Sukhoi upgrade will not happen in a big bang fashion, but it will happen in a staggered manner. RWR is one of the very important components of Super Sukhoi upgrade. Back in August 2021, it was reported that Indian Air Force is going ahead with Rs 1000 crore project for the upgrade of RWR for the fleet of 125 Su-30 MKIs. However, it is not clear as how many Su-30 MKIs have been upgraded till date with Dhruti RWR, but we have been seeing it integrated with most of the Su-30 MKIs. Now, as per the latest update, the Navratna Defense PSU Bharat Electronics Limited had signed a license agreement for transfer of technology with Combat Aircraft System Development and Integration Center of DRDO for transfer of technology of digital radar warning receiver to Indian Armed Forces. In the statement released on 18th November, BL said that digital radar warning receiver is a state of art airborne electronic warfare system that would provide versatile situational awareness to fighter platform in dense signal scenario, offering excellent sensitivity, good parameter measurement, accuracy, and high probability of intercept against dense signals. The transfer of technology will enable BEL to manufacture and supply the digital radar warning receiver to armed forces. Through this, DRDO will transfer the complete details of technical know-how, testing and maintenance method for quality assurance to BEL with requisite data on the functioning of the product. This will further pave the way for the mass production of Dhruti RWR, which is expected to start from December 2022 onwards. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.